Thanksgiving is still a week away, but you wouldn't know it if you were outside tonight. It's another cold one, and it means pet owners need to be thinking about more than themselves. Leaving your pets out in dangerous conditions could result in a visit from animal control. News 18's Brittany Tyner is live outside the Almost Home Humane Society in Lafayette with more. Brittany? Dan, when the temperatures drop much like they have tonight, the Almost Home Humane Society received several calls from concerned residents who are worried about an animal out in the cold weather. The people here want to remind you if it's too cold for you to be outside for a long period of time, the same is probably true for your pet. Yeah. <laughs> Adult cats snuggle with volunteers, kittens cozy up together, and this beagle cuddles up on blankets at the Almost Home Humane Society. But as we head into the cold months, the shelter takes in fewer animals. Our busiest times of the year are the spring and summer when we take in lots of kittens. Um, throughout the winter months, we're mostly getting the adult animals in, so our population in the shelter is down a little bit, but our adoptions do increase with the holiday seasons. While the animals at the Almost Home Humane Society are warm inside, some animals are left outside in the bitter cold of winter. Executive Director Stacy Rogers says make sure you realize how cold it is before letting your pets out. Watch them when they're outside to make sure they're not out there too long to get chilly. Rogers says along with the cold pavement and snow and ice on the ground, pet owners need to be aware of the ice melt they use on driveways and sidewalks. She says make sure it's safe for your pets. Make sure their feet aren't getting irritated. You can buy doggy boots. You can buy... Um, creams and salves that you can put on their feet to kind of protect them when they're outside in cold weather. And when a pet isn't protected in the cold weather, the police and animal control could get involved. Sergeant Bob Baumgardner with the Lafayette Police Department says officers respond to several calls from concerned citizens throughout the winter. If they, you know, feel that the animal is in danger, they'll try to make contact with the resident, like I said, get them inside. If not, and, and they feel that it's urgent and they do need to get inside. Most likely what they will do will they'll contact dispatch and dispatch will um, get a hold of one of our on-call animal control officers. The city of Lafayette has an ordinance when it comes to animal neglect that could result in citations or even removing an animal from a home. So again, if it is just dangerously cold outside, get your pets inside, get them into a garage, just be smart about it. Reporting live here in Lafayette, Brittany Tyner, News 18.